with any partner you work with, your professional colleague or whatever, um, as you know, um, it does take um, a kind of patience and understanding. We've been doing this for a while, so we kind of know where, I think, yeah, uh, we where always, we work well together and not well together. We teach a class called Honeybees and Humans. We sort of bring different, different perspectives and different expertise to the class. We um, have our different grooves. Mm -hmm. Our research life and our, our, the life, our private life, you might say, we live, it's rather seamless. <laughs> We're married. We're married, in fact. <laughs> we have a child. <laughs> It would probably be helpful if we had more separate because we end up talking about work like at home, yes, you know, at and breakfast and at, at breakfast, dinner and that whatever. Would be, and so. That's true. Um, so we were at the University of Illinois. Christina was a postdoc and I was a doctoral student. So I had to go down the hallway to get some live bees to extract their genes to sequence their proteins. And you were the one who had the bees. And that's how we met each other. <laughs> I actually knew of Harlan beforehand because when I was coming to Illinois, I was really excited about working on pheromones and chemical signaling, and I was like, ah, oh, somebody should really, you know, sequence the olfactory receptors. Maybe I could do that. And I beat you to it. I you did. <laughs> <laughs> I was very happy for you to do it. It's yeah, a lot well, of work. Yeah, there you go. It was a lot of work. We do bring complementary skills. Mm -hmm. I feel like we're always learning something new about endlessly. bees. Endlessly. Endlessly. Every time you turn around, there's something fascinating to learn about bees, and, and there's, there's so many species. They're out in your backyard, and they're waiting to be discovered, and so it's just it's very exciting to, to work with these, these animals. When I tell people that we teach a class together, they're like, how is that going? And I'm like, it's actually going really well. It's just a wonderful sort of entry into the natural world. One of the things I think which is great about bees is that um, you can find them everywhere. And if you plant flowers, you know, even on your patio in an urban area, you can get bees. It's just a fun area to work in, and it's just really easy uh, to, to bring it to other people and incorporate it into all sorts of different parts of our lives. I had a friend of mine who was um, an academic advisor, and she told me how one of her students was talking with her about the student's classes, and the student said, you know, I'm taking this class. And I think there might be something going on with the professors because they're standing really close to each other and they're talking a lot and whatever. And so, uh, so, so we laughed and we realized like maybe we should let the students know that we're married. And so we sort of just get that out of the way um, right away.